Hey guys, so the bands have arrived. As of uh, tomorrow, uh, the 30th of uh, May, uh, three guards are banned in uh, standard, uh, standard play. And uh, these are Fable of the Mirror Breaker, uh, Invoke Despair, as well as uh, Reconer Bankbuster. So um, I have uh, my thoughts about them and uh, then I'm gonna show you a few cards that you can replace uh, Fable with. So did it deserve to get ban Fable? I think yes. However, it hurts to say that. But yeah, it was uh, one of the most played cards. Everybody knows it, everybody hated it. It's uh, two for one and it's even uh, like the best uh, three drop uh, in uh, reanimator decks because you get to discard cards as well. So from the minute I saw it, uh, I thought that Fable was busted and uh, I had a good time uh, playing with that card. Invoke Despair, so annoying, man, turn four, shield red, turn five, Invoke Despair, and that's pretty much GG. Now with the new Chandra that uh, doubles the instants and sorceries, you get double the invokes. Uh, that's crazy. Definitely deserve the ban. Rankoner Bankbuster, it's just uh, so annoying the value that you get for two, two mana. And all the control decks play it, so I'm uh, glad to see them uh, see it banned. But yeah, all these three, they uh, pretty much deserved it. And um, here's the text about uh, the reasoning behind it. And uh, a few uh, interesting points is that on August 7, they'll be announcing a new uh, ban wave, pretty much, uh, if there is need. But let's go to uh, Arena and let's see. So this is my Invoked Alvada deck that uses like white and uh, red mana mainly to uh, reanimate. So I have uh, four copies of Fable here, but uh, I've made uh, a few picks that uh, I might start. Uh, I mean, not might, I am going to play uh, to replace Fable. So. Most of them I'm already playing, so Catharic Pyre lets you uh, discard up to two cards and draw that many. Also deals three damage, so I'm currently playing two of these, so might uh, add a few more. Uh, we'll, uh, so this has green mana in it, but it's really good, so it gets, you get a treasure token and discard and draw. So if I can somehow manage green in this um, setup, then... Uh, this would be really interesting, but yeah, it's a two drop, so you can't really miss your lands and uh, tap lands and whatnot. You kind of need to play it on turn two. And also, if you flip it, uh, the Cliff Charger has pretty cool ability to search your li library for a battle card or a land card. So you can search for Invasion of Talvada, for example. But yeah, the colors get kind of weird. Uh, Restoration of a Ganjo. I played it, uh, but uh, yeah, if uh, opponent is uh, aggressive and you only get a planes, extra plane on turn three, then uh, you're pretty much defeated. But yeah, if if it flips, that's a great uh, blocker and uh, also makes uh, like the spirit uh, creatures and also has a discard ability. So maybe, maybe, definitely will test it out. Adding more bitter reunions. I mean, why not? I, I'm already playing two, might add even more. Uh, I used to play it, but I took it out. But if it dies, you get a treasure token, which pretty much uh, is the same as the um, Shaman token. I mean, not really, but uh, it's a 3-1, so it's kind of a threat uh, in defense as well. Uh, might even test it out because uh, getting to turn four, turn five portal is... Um, really really crucial especially against uh, all these aggressive decks so this is a possibility as well as a thrill of possibility but uh, so it's an instant speed which is nice uh, to counter like uh, trespasser you cast it in the end, end of the turn so yeah uh, peak score but it's a four drop but uh, you get a discard as well as two uh, treasure tokens and draw two cards so uh, I haven't really played that card because 
because uh, Fable is so good, but now I have to, I think. It's a decent card, it's a decent card. And uh, talking about decent cards, the Elder Dragon War, I'm currently playing one copy, but uh, might add even more, because you always need to sweep and discard, and uh, the token's not bad either. So this one uh, has uh, the same thing as the Thrill of Possibility, so you get to draw two cards if you discard a card. Uh, it's a battle card, and if it flips, uh, you can discard the card, play three mana, and pay, and also get two tokens, as well as all your creatures uh, get the plus one, plus one, and haste. So it's kind of a mix of uh, like, um, where is it, Bitter Reunion, as well as uh, Thrill of Possibility, but you have to flip it. It's a four, four uh, like defense, so maybe add um, Nahiri's uh, Witchcraft, or what's that uh, called, and uh, you can flip it like that. But yeah, these are uh, my my thoughts, and also I forgot one. Um, it's an artifact, and it lets you flip the day and night. What's it called? Um, oh my god! Well, uh, I'll type it in the comments. But yeah, these are my thoughts about uh, replacing Fable. Uh, in terms of replacing uh, Bankbuster and Invoke uh, Despair, I don't really play these decks that much, so no comment on that. But uh, what do you guys think about uh, the, the band, first of all, and what do you think about the replacements for the green, white, uh, I mean, uh, white, red uh, reanimation decks? So, yeah, guys, leave your comments below. And see you in the next video.